Alice pulled off the ball, taken by Armitage, just snapped by Armo. Is good, and David Armitage gets his first. Last year, I, was, I think I was on a similar path, um, and then I got struck down by eight weeks with my knee that I missed, and then I came back, and I didn't have that fitness that I had early on in the first four games. So just having a niggle-free, injury-free season probably matured a bit more, and also, one conversation I had with Richo early on in the preseason was he instilled belief in me. He goes, mate, looking from the outside, they were a little bit worried about me in times during games. And I was kind of like, oh, really? So I kind of thought, well, maybe I am good enough to take my game to the next level. He's been great. He's just, just a, such an honest, down-to-earth guy. And he'll tell you how it is, what you need to work on, and basically gives you confidence to go for things. So he's really good with the older guys and also with the younger guys. You know, he, he tells the leaders it's your club. He's just, uh, you know, the director and he just steers the ship, basically. And, you know, we try and lead by example and hopefully the young guys jump on. It's going to be a draw. It's unbelievable. But it's happened. I've seen um, the highs and lows. I was around, you know, when we had our last crack at it, 09 and 10, and sort of on the fringe was emergency a lot and didn't get to play in any of the grand finals. and. You know, obviously I would have liked to, but being young and, and probably not fit enough then. And then going back the last couple of years, we've sort of been down the bottom of the ladder, you know, wooden spooners and you know, the club was trying to turn over a new leaf and think who they've brought in now, you know, with Matty Finnis and the likes have been terrific in, in driving the club. And yeah, it's very exciting and the momentum that we've got going. The young guys, you know, I was once their age and the enthusiasm and, and that that they bring to someone like myself or, or Nick or Joey, the older boys, is just awesome and it gets you up and that's why you play footy is to win. Oh definitely Lenny, Nicky Dale, BJ Goddard, they were brutally honest and they were just fierce competitors. They wanted to win, they wanted to be better than everyone else and that kind of early days in me I was like I really wanted to be you know, a competitor and who cares who you're playing against. They might have a Brownlow or a Best and Ferris or a medal. You know, that was that made me more determined to come up against them and try and beat them. I've always probably been a, a leader game day and, and through my actions, just the way that I play. But yeah, I've certainly, with Lenny leaving, I think I've, I've certainly taken it to another level on the field as well. And, and I probably have a little bit of you know weight on my shoulders where these young guys are so young and inexperienced in the team. You know, Lukey Dunstan, Seb Ross, the boys that go through there, all the jacks that go through the middle that, you know, I kind of feel like a bit of a father figure for them and try and help them as much as I can game day and throughout the week. So that's the role I've tried to take and um, I suppose it's helped my game go to a new level.